Have you ever felt that the online challenges for Rayman Legends was a bit too restrictive? Maybe you wanted to play a challenge that wasn't up today. Perhaps you needed to download a certain program and mod that is required for an upcoming tournament? Luckily, thanks to Olabri, we will be able to provide a program that can fill such needs. There will be a link to this program in the description below. Since this program is not entirely straightforward to some, I thought I would make a video tutorial on how to use it. Step 1. Back up your bundle PC. This is just in case something goes wrong and the program is unable to fix it. You can find it here if you have the Steam version, or if you have the Uplay version, you can find it here. Step 2. Open the Seed Manager. With Rayman Legends closed, press T in the program to install the Training Room mod. This is required to prevent cheating in the ranked online challenges. If you want to uninstall the mod, just press T again. Step 3. Once you have the Training Mood installed, launch the game. You will probably notice that the Training Room painting replaced the Challenges painting. Go ahead and hop into it and go into a challenge you would like to play. You will then be taken to a menu. This menu looks a little buggy, but there isn't anything we can do to fix it at this time. There are four challenge types that you can see here. The as far as you can challenge here is going to be the normal daily variant of the challenge. The as far as you can challenge below that is the daily extreme variant, and so on. If you want to play the weekly variants, they are listed again further down the list, but they act as weekly challenges instead of daily challenges. Choose what challenge type you want to play and wait for the 3 2 1 go sequence to finish when you start the challenge. Minimize the game and bring up the seed manager and press the S key. It'll search for the seed in the game's memory, and then it'll ask you what seed you want to be used. You could either put in any random seed, or you could click in the link in the description below, which will take you here. It's a spreadsheet that contains many seeds from challenges of the past. You might find this handy. Once you've entered the seed, all you simply need to do is restart the level you're currently on, and the seed will be loaded. This program is in beta and has only been tested on 64-bit Windows 7 platforms. If you encounter any bugs, be sure to contact the author of the program. His contact info is in the description. If you have any further questions on how to use this program, feel free to ask in the comments below. Otherwise, I'll see you guys later.